Hi all, MC Get Better here and in this video I will be talking about which is the best Minecraft server hosting. Quick review, there is no best Minecraft server hosting as you could say, it actually depends on your preferences which we will be going over today. Servers I'll be comparing is Rev Revive Node Hosting, Soul Node Hosting, Bisect Hosting, XRO Ton Hosting, MC Pro Hosting, Apex Hosting, Eternals, Minehut, Shockbite. Let's start off with MC Pro Hosting. Now, they say that they their plan now support Minecraft Java Edition and Bedrock. But I have done a little bit of digging around and there's only one Minecraft section. That means that these servers are for Minecraft Java and you have to connect through them through Geezer and you can install Floodgate plugins. Please double check this, I'm not really sure about this and if you find that I'm wrong, please tell me in the comments below, I'll correct it immediately. They have lots of good pl plans starting at $7.99, the most, well, the best being the Ender Dragon. Personally, I think that the Wither should be there because the Wither is more powerful than the Ender Dragon. But never mind, let's leave that for now. Overall, um, MC Pro Hosting is really good hosting and their support is amazing. They have a lot of well, hostings, not just Minecraft. You can see that. And Hytale, which is... Hypixels, um, Hypixel is a huge Java Minecraft server, and they are creating creating another whole game called Hytale, which is different from Minecraft, kind of like a Minecraft modded world. Now we will be taking a look at Apex Hosting. Apex Hosting has also has really good support and lots and lots of features, including custom softwares. Let's take a look at their pricing for now, shall we? Okay, here we are. So they have 2 GB RAM, 3 GB RAM, 4, 5, 6, sorry, 4, 5, 6, 8, 10, and proxy. And they have an EX series for 15 GB RAM. So personally, like they said, 4GB RAM is the best choice because most normal servers need 4GB RAM because they have around 30 players as a small friend server. But if you're in a if you're creating a full-blown minigame server, I suggest you go with their EX series. Anyway, their pricing is a bit more expensive than um, MC Pro hosting. Shockbite also provides the same services from 1 GB RAM to 16 GB RAM. They have many plans, dirt, sand, cobblestone, iron, and whatever, you name it. Their pricing is $2.5 per GB RAM. Much, much cheaper than any other hosting, MC Pro Hosting or Apex. But just saying 1 GB RAM isn't really enough to fully power the server unless you're playing a 5 player server, even though they say 8. Next, let's move on to Minehut. Minehut is the best hosting for free Java servers. Other than Minehut, the only other hosting that provides that, the only other popular and good hosting that provides that is Eternos. But Minehut has, Minehut has a few more features about starting the server when people join and custom plugins. That's why in Java servers it reigns supreme. Let's take a look at their pricing. They have a lot of, uh, they have premium services for credits, which you can buy, and free services, which is a 1 GB RAM server. Well, that's the one thing where there's a clash between Minehut and Eternos because Eternos gives you two GB RAM servers. That's double the power of a Minehut server. But uh, Minehut, like I said, you can upload custom plugins and start the server when you join, which is amazing. So there's still a battle going on and I cannot finalize this. But according to my point of view, well, just according to me, 
it's just my opinion it's not a fact your opinion can differ i prefer mine for java servers they don't have bedrock hosting so eternal twin supreme and bedrock next let's look at their pricing free on gb run daily daily and monthly provide the same thing a 2 gb ram server this monthly is much 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 cheaper because you don't want to pay daily i mean nobody wants to buy a 2 gb ram server for one day that's that's not exactly worth anything minimum is monthly i would take and if you want a premium service you can go with the monthly ultimated ultimate or monthly 75 there are there's um ram is 6 gb and the monthly credit is 2270 but if you're a big server owner i suggest you go with the 10 gb ram plan they give you two free server slots and i have two servers in that one is my um just a server for me and my friends another is well another server for me and my friends just uh i don't use it anymore kind of permanently switch to a uh, premium paid server hosting which is soul node i'll be talking more about soul node when i come to the soul node option so i think yeah i think we're good with mine hut that's all we could say anyway i would just like to remind everyone who's watching this if you are enjoying this video Please drop a like. Subscribing is 100% up to you, but just saying, I'd really appreciate it if you do. Next, moving on to XROTON. They charge you only for the time you use their server, meaning you don't have to pay if you are you're, you're offline. You can just start your server anytime you want. They also have the same feature, and they have a wide variety of um, softwares. I'm gonna take the velocity proxy software if you don't know what a proxy is it's basically like um one server which hides hundreds of servers just one ip in which all the servers are kind of clogged into and they have multiple plugins which is because you don't need too many because you don't really need skywars plugins for a proxy you can just dig more you can i'll make another video on what a proxy is they have rams um, ranging from 1 gb ram to 16 gb ram and each gb ram costs one credit an hour and their credit cost is one 100 credits per for one euro but if you're gonna buy it it's a minimum of 300 credits three euros Anyway, and they also have Discord and a lot of support. The last one, well, second last one, I, I would be like, uh, I would like to show you is, well, Bisect Hosting. Well, that's not the second last one. Huge correction. Bisect Hosting is also a good quality hosting, but I'm not really in sync with their prices. Kind of extreme. Now I, I choose paper over MC 1.17.1 10 plugins and I want I, I want a lot of players 100 plus Now here look at this they say no overselling Well, I think I, I really doubt that they have a lot of good um, They have a lot of good features too the DDoS protection and etc But they charge you for a lot of things which shouldn't be charged for it wants support agreed that's that's worth it but five dollars a month mm -hmm. no no dice backups they charge you for backups too which is terrible dedicated ip everyone almost everyone wants their port as to five the default java port are you kidding me I choose oh my god is that 78 dollars per month and their gb ram is 26 well that's a lot i agree but and this this isn't really worth it why do you need 26 gb ram for a uh, well 
100 players that's that's not needed <laughs> and you don't even get to configure the ram you want they charge you for unlimited slots which is terrible they even charge you for a dedicated ip and backups which is also terrible i don't want automatic restarts because i i just don't want it don't ask me why but that's luckily that's free and yep that's it about bisect hosting now let's switch to revive node hosting a huge opponent to soul node and rating one of the top most minecraft hosting with one dollar per gb ram per month i'm not really sure i mean that's the best pricing we have until this point of the video if you exclude the free pricing and they give you 100% uptime servers and their premium hosting see this is the best thing about revive no they don't have budget hosting for cheap quality they have premium hosting for budget pricing which is absolutely amazing extreme is a much better specs for the computer and the hosting for much lesser lag and better performance mostly used by um, big server owners like Hypixel but they have much more GB RAM not just 16 and suppose we want an extreme 16 GB RAM server per month that'll cost sorry yearly that'll cost $600 which is a really good price next one we'll move on to soul node hosting the hosting I use and you'll see why soon is that zero point nine dollars per month with no tax my god that's that's better than that even in revive node you have tax from revive node and the payment tax in this there is absolutely no tax that's amazing they also give you a demo server which provides such high quality just look at their specs they start at 3 GB RAM, which is okay, it's absolutely okay because a minimum to run a good Minecraft server, 3 GB RAM is okay for 5 to 6 people. It'll run the server smoothly, especially if it's an SMP. If it's a survival minigame, I'm sorry, not survival minigame, a minigame server, I suggest you go with 7 GB RAM at least because you'll have, well, at least. Um, 80 players on it at the time being the 7 GB RAM is the minimum requirement they also have bedrock hosting and proxies but since in this video we're only taking a look at minecraft hosting and not discord bot hosting i will not be digging deep into those and their bedrock um, edition hosting is amazing and with if you click on the link in the description and use code nm195 you get a 10 percent off on your order which is once again amazing after this the only other hosting which is free we have is eternos eternos is well used by millions of people well and coming back to soul node i just forgot to tell you that they have all softwares available including custom softwares which is amazing and they also have the server transfer options which is well a pretty rare sight to see in hostings nobody really transfers or completely moves your server and they don't charge you per month it's just an open ticket one time some of you might think that since i'm an affiliate with soul node i'm praising it but that is absolutely wrong i this is a 100 percent honest answer and i have no um, I have no like feelings for the hosting. This is honest. I've this is the pure specs with no strings attached. Perfect. Well, next, let's go on to the leaderboard. The leaderboard is XR um, Soul Node for 100% uptime servers. XR on for rare competitions. Bisect hosting for yeah the most overpriced hosting. Eternals free Minecraft bedrock. There was too much in Eternals to explain since it's basically a copy of Exoroton, just a free version. Now, their Exoroton offers a lot more features, which 
I already mentioned in the video and Mineheart for free Java hostings. Anyway, thanks for watching guys and I'll be back soon.